Hi, this is Robert Plank from papertemplate.com and what I'm going to show you today is how to in one click resize and convert any kind of image you want and so in my case I'll have a lot of images in a single folder or I just might save a screen grab from a video of some kind and if I double click on this well this is a huge file right this is a PNG file and it's uh, 1024 pixels wide it's a hundred uh, kilobytes and I want to have this in a more you know web friendly size and I really want to be able to right click and do this create thumbnail and then in the other screen it's output it let me drag it over so it created this 30 kilobyte JPEG that's 480 pixels wide that I can more easily put onto a web page. So, you know, if I have a lot of these or if I just, you know, uh, create a thumbnail for a video and I want to size it down really quickly, I don't want to have to always open up Photoshop, go rough, image, resize, size it down, say OK, save it again. That kind of time really adds up a one, just a one button solution. And here it is today. I'm about to show you. So how the heck do you do it? I'm glad you asked. Basically, we're going to install a program called Image Magic. That's magic with a K, and that's a free program that will basically allow you to run commands uh, to a DOS prompt that will read an image, do some stuff to it, like resize and convert it, and then save it back out. And just for your own reference, uh, the command we're going to run is what you see right in front of you here. It's this image magic program. And we're going to say, well, I want to open this file, screenshot.png. I want to resize it to this 480 by 281. Uh, and this, this carrot, top hat character, that is going to say if it needs to be a little bigger, that's OK. And then this last part says we want to save it back onto itself. But this .jpg makes sure that whatever final output it's in ends up being a .jpg. So if we, if we open up a bitmap or a GIF or a PNG or whatever, because there's this .jpg, it ends up converting it to .jpg. So just this command right here will open up any image file, but we're going to give it a PNG, resize, and save it to JPEG. So once we know that, uh, well, basically we add an entry to our Windows registry and so that whenever we right click on a PNG file, we can add a right click entry called create thumbnail that will pass in the image that we just right clicked resize and save it back. So a lot of different steps, but once you see it all in place, I think that uh, you'll have a lot of fun and enjoy it. So let me delete some stuff already so we can start from scratch. Okay, so let me, this might help be a little bit to see where I'm going here. So I'm in my registry and I'm going to delete my create thumbnail. Okay, so starting from scratch completely, let's see what we've got. I've got my JPEG, I'll delete that got my PNG, I can right click and see there's no way to create a thumbnail in one click. I'd have to send it to Photoshop or paint.net, resize, save it back. So what I want to do is first of all, install our program called Image Magic. So let me open up my web browser and then I'll just search for Image Magic with a K at the end. So Image Magic uh, takes us to imagemagic.org, click on that. And then I'm on Windows, so I'll click on Windows, and then I'll just grab the top one it shows me, download, and it has an installer and it runs it. But what's kind of confusing is that, well, there's not, it doesn't really give you a program to run. It's a, you know, it's a command line kind of deal. And so for me at least, the place that this saves it is in this program files image magic. Okay. So program files image magic and then the file we're going to mess with is this convert.exe. So I right click and go to properties. So it's base it's going to be in this folder. So let me actually bust out a notepad. So the file that we care about is going to be in this folder and it's convert.exe. So this is what we will pass the image we want to open and then the things that we then want to do with it. Okay, so in this case, it'll be convert.exe and then screenshot.png 
and then do a dash resize for 80 by 281 with the little carrot and then I guess just avert your eyes for a second dash set file name F uh, we want just the beginning part dot JPEG and so all this fanciness this first part will resize this last part will uh, rename it to the same name we gave it but dot JPEG and in the process convert it to dot JPEG and I think they have somewhere on this image magic site they'll give you the um, the different commands you can run um, so yeah I mean you can you can draw stuff you can do all kinds of things like that but I mean I'm just gonna let you mess around with this on your own time what I'm doing today is I'm resizing and I'm saving as a JPEG and I will put under this video uh, the exact commands to do and stuff so I mean we're already half of the way there right we already have image magic installed and we know what command we want to run we just need to add the right click menu because once again as of right now if I right click on this screenshot.png there is no uh, there's nothing I can really do right from this menu. So what I'll do is I will go to my uh, taskbar. So let me show it over here. All right, I got my taskbar, and I'll and I'll click on the start menu. And if you don't have this, if you're on Windows 7, you hit Windows key R, and it'll bring up this run box. Right, and either way takes you to the same place. Type in R E G E D I T. Oops, not red dirt, but red it. Reg edit. Okay, reg edit. And it'll ask, do I want to run it? Yes, I do. All right. So what we're looking for is we want to find the program that runs .png file. So we go to this H key classes root, and it has all this dot whatever. And we find dots. PNG is in here somewhere. It's it's faster to browse than to search on this. So dot PNG. Okay. And what we're looking for is this default. And we want to write down what this data is. And for me, it's PNG file. And probably it's the same for you. I think this is just win, the Windows 8. I think yeah, I'm on Windows 8. Uh, the default viewer for PNG files. So we're going once again. Uh, Windows key R reg edit. H key classes root find the dot PNG they call these folder things here keys find the dot PNG key and then we're looking for a PNG file cool so this is what we're looking for moving forward PNG file one word all lowercase so I continue scrolling down until I find PNG file so here we go here's PNG file okay then we'll pop that open and then we want to find this thing that says shell. So basically under the shell, now we can add whatever commands we want. So whenever we right click a PNG file, it'll we can have, you know, have it sent to any program we choose. So we're at uh, H key classes root, PNG file, shell. So we'll right click and then we will go new key. And then I'll say create thumbnail. All right. And then inside this create thumbnail, right click new key command. Cool. So now we're just making sure that we're clicking over in this command key on the left. On the right, there's this default. We double click, and this will be the command to run. And so uh, remember, we had this, uh, this notepad area right here. So most of this is going to stay the same, except for this screenshot.png. We'll change this to a percent one, and this percent one means that it will uh, run whatever command we had right clicked. Okay, and then the other thing I'm going to do, and you know, don't worry, I'll, you can just copy uh, this right there uh, out of from below the video. Is there's this other percent stuff? I guess there's one here and one there. We need to make it two percent signs just to not confuse it. So basically, when we paste it in this area, we're going to have to have change these to two percent signs. But don't worry, uh, you just just grab what, and I think put, we need quotes around that just to be safe. So basically, when we're going to make this extra right-click entry, where it'll run this convert.exe image magic program, we'll say process the file we just right-clicked, 
resize and then save it as a JPEG. Okay, so I'll just highlight all this, right click and copy, and then paste it right in there. Click OK, and these changes should show up instantly. Let's see what, what happens here. So I guess I'll just minimize that. So here's our PNG file, once again hovering over. It's 1024 by 600 in size, and I will right click, create thumbnail, this is new. Click on that, and then the other screen, it created this screenshot.jpg, and I hover over it, and it has been resized down to 480 wide, and it's a JPEG, and everything looks good going forward. So once again, to recap, to make sure you got it, you might have to watch this video once or twice. We installed a program called Image Magic with a K. And what I wanted to do, and this folder might be a little different for you, but I went and found the exact folder name, and we're going to run convert.exe and pass it a PNG file, do this dash resize to resize the file, and do all this other fanciness at the end to save it as that file name .jpg. Then to add the right click menu, go and do your Windows key R, reg edit, browse to H key classes root, find .png, and see what's stored under default. In my case, it was PNG file. So then I keep scrolling down on the left to find PNG file and open up the shell sub key in there and add my own sub key under shell called create thumbnail then add a new key called command inside of create thumbnail and then I just put in uh, the command making sure to replace the screenshot.jpg with a percent sign one making sure that it would pass along the file name we right clicked and making sure to replace the two or the percent sign in each case with a double percent sign okay and I'll, I'll give you the uh, the code to paste into your registry just below this video but this is Robert Plank from paper template and that is how to one click resize and convert your image file so I'll delete that once again and so even if you had you know 10 20 100 files in one folder you just select them all right click great thumbnail and then boom in literally fractions of a second it has now resized this from 1024 down to 480 and made it a jpeg file as well and so i mean let's just say that uh, in your case if you didn't want to convert to jpeg well all you'd have to do was just uh, don't include the uh, dash set part i believe and then and if you want to reset it to a different size just change the dimensions in the dash resize but either way install image magic here's the command and then i just added a right click menu and that is just that easy just that simple to add a one click jpeg resizing and converting right click menu in windows papertemplate.com i'm robert plank have a fantastic day won't you